What's up guys, Freeman here. Uh, yeah, back again. It took me a while to make this because I've been getting my hair pulled for the last for ages and I'm still in some sort of a draw. Uh, but yeah, uh, my insomnia is starting to go away, which is pretty good. And my uh, lucid dreaming is getting a lot more less frequent. Is it more or less frequent? Is it is becoming a lot less frequent, um, which is great because it's nice to be um, having to go to bed and wake up instead of going to bed and being transported to a thousand different fantasy sexual lands that usually end up with me doing some unspeakable things and then getting trapped in some places. You know, it's kind of strange. I have this, I have this, okay, off topic. I have this recurring dream, right? Um, but it, it, it's not like recurring, it's, it's a recurring theme in my dream where it's like a post-apocalyptic survival like situation. And either it can be like on a tropical jungle or some random planet, all these crazy hills and stuff. Oh, most often, like time, it's like it's like in this urban environment, sort of like Fallout. It's like if you don't know what Fallout is, it's like the, the planet's ruined and everyone's living in these vaults. So I'll go around like find the resistance and run from shit. And it's, it's I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Um, maybe some of you Jungians can try and unpack that for me, cause yeah. Um, but yeah, so um, I'm not having those anymore. <laughs> well, less frequently anymore. Anyway. Um, and especially when you're doing nerf up, you, I, I usually find myself in a situation where I'm sort of, I'm sort of just, just like with a girl, and we're going on these like big adventures, and we sort of lose each other and find each other and like fight, fight things off, which is pretty damn awesome actually. I, I'm talking about dreams too much. I apologize, but quite honestly, I, I, I don't really care, man. So my insomnia is gone. My lucid dreaming is starting to get better, um, and also my voice has gotten a lot, well, slightly more calm. I actually feel a lot calmer as well. I think maybe that's because the last two days I've been hurt time and like crazy but I feel a lot calmer than I did the last two days um, and plus I'm not too much worried about what getting to 60 or dead getting to 90 is, is really going to be about because uh, there's someone else who I know is actually trying to start the same thing and um, he's sort of fascinated with it and saying you know this will help a lot and this will fix a lot of his problems and it's like yeah that's true but it's not so much that no fuck is there to fix something it's more that you're on a journey and no fuck is part of that journey and whether you get there or not, as long as you're going there consistently. But if you focus too much on doing something just so that you can become, you know, better or, or uh, well, I mean, doing something, doing no fact to make yourself to for self improvement is great. Let me just say that. But it's it's a very common thing whenever someone's doing no fact or some sort of personal development thing to to think that, especially if it's the first time, to think that all of a sudden this is going to make all their problems go away, and that that once they get to this point. That they'll just suddenly find themselves just like, oh my god, everything's amazing. Um, and I found myself at that point, physically. Physically, I did. I did a juice fast for 28 days. I was doing no fap as well for 28 days. I felt like fucking god on earth. Excuse my French. But that was the physical. The psychological part wasn't fixed. And I ended up sabotaging really quickly because I have this ingrained belief that I don't deserve to be happy and I don't deserve to be free. And I'm working on that a lot, but it's just sort of looking at it as if don't put all your eggs in one basket, because you'll quickly find that that that, that basket has a has um that basket has a few holes in it that can <laughs> that that all your eggs can potentially fall out of if you don't you know take care of the rest of it, you know if you don't you know, get another basket and put it in there, you know that's if that's an analogy at all. Uh, but yeah, I just wanted to make a quick check in, uh, check in to be honest. I was actually planning on making a lot more videos today, but just the, with the withdrawal and I just trying to take it easy on myself really, because like doing a juice fast and doing a nofap and then just like pumping out like three or four videos a day, which I was planning to do, and then like have them all like fully produced and, sh and stuff is not possible. So that's tuning in guys, and I'll see you all next time.